Australia's fastest female steeplechaser could be left out of the team for London despite missing a selection deadline by just one day. Queenslander Genevieve Lacaz is appealing the decision and as Max Futcher reports, she has the support of our Olympics chief. She's fast and getting faster, but will Genevieve Lacaz's speed in the steeplechase be enough to get her to London? Her personal best win at an American meet on Wednesday was inside the Olympic A qualifying time, but outside Athletics Australia's selection deadline. I just don't understand. Like, I've hit the mark. I've proven to be up in the world-class standard. Um, and, you know, I want to run for the country and be the only one to represent that event. Her father travelled to watch her race in the US, where she's on scholarship to Florida University. Their hopes now hinge on an appeal they've lodged with the selection committee. She's made the time. The time is 9.43. She did a 9.41.15. She's um, the best in Australia by a long way. I'm sending the prayers now. Um, it, it's going to be a long few days, I'll say the least. The 22-year-old's times have improved dramatically in recent weeks in a gruelling sport where Australia is underrepresented. It's pretty deep, as you can see, but it'll be filled up with water. You've got an uh, uh, A-standard athlete here, why not take it? There's no one being affected here. It's either she goes or no one goes. If her appeal fails, she'll then have to plead her case to an independent tribunal. But she does have some high-level support inside the AOC. If she's clearly past an A-qualifying time, and she, so far as I'm concerned, she'll be going to the Games. I've never been this fit in my life and it's just like, it's almost like everything's coming together. But for now, her Olympic dream is in limbo. And in just the past hour, Athletics Australia has released a statement saying they are rejecting Genevieve Lacaz's appeal. They say they can't recognise her performance in Indianapolis earlier this week. So it leaves her until 5 o'clock on Tuesday to appeal directly to the AOC. So it's a situation of she was fast enough, but she wasn't fast enough, if you know what I mean, Bill.